Mass Effect is an epic sci-fi action-adventure RPG that first released in 2007 along with Tumblr and the iPhone. It went on to spawn a beloved trilogy as well as a fourth entry which may or may not exist depending on who you speak to. With the original trilogy getting the legendary edition treatment and it also being the latest Christmas offering for PS Plus, more people than ever are finally taking the plunge into this epic trilogy, or adding it to their backlog. What is this? I don't know, I... I don't know. In this review, we'll take a look at Mass Effect, and whether or not you should free it from your backlog. You take on the role of Commander Shepard, a decorated soldier who loves giving speeches. The captain gave up everything so I could have this chance. Taking the elevator. Working with the press. I've had enough of your snide insinuations. And doing a weird nod whenever they shake someone's hand. You're on a routine mission that's definitely not a routine mission, because Oz from Buffy said so. Only an idiot believes the official story. You tell the eager young soldier that they have a long career ahead of them, which is apparently like saying I'll be right back in a horror movie. You're young, Corporal. You have a long career ahead of you. One minute, 37 seconds later. Then there's betrayal. I've got it under control. Mystery. What is that? Off in the distance. Action. A bit that looks like it was directed by James Wan. And before you know it, you're on the Citadel, and you've joined the Spectres, which is a bit like being Space 007. And your mission, 007, is to go out into the galaxy and find Saren and his evil space fish. But I must warn you, Bishop from Aliens will give you side quests all the time. Shepard. This is Admiral Hackett, Commander Shepard. Normandy, Admiral Hackett here. I received some troubling information, Commander. Shepard. 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 Commander Shepard. Big surprise, the Alliance needs you again. <laughs> but you're not alone on your big space mission. You have your crazy space family to help you out. You have the boring dude who wants to talk politics. The Citadel Council's not gonna be happy about that. The one with a less than evolved view on things. It's not racism, not really. The really smart kid who's also allergic to everything. I've never seen a drive cord like this before. The one who just started uni and thinks you all want to hear about it. I have spent the past 50 years trying to figure out what happened to them. The angry older guy who doesn't give a crap anymore. Go ask the Quarian if you want stories. And then there's the one you actually want to see. Commander Shepard, Garrus Vakarian. Garrus Vakarian. Seriously, I find it hard to believe that Bioware didn't know how much we'd all love Garrus. Because when you first meet him, he's in front of this fountain. Sploosh. The voice acting in this game is really good, and you can either play as Broshep or Femshep, and both are brilliantly played. Most of us pick Femshep though, because the Broshep customization options are downright ugly compared to his default model, and Femshep has the added bonus of being able to bang Garrus. Each of the main missions takes you to a new world, where you explore, fight, and negotiate your way through to the next big plot point, and also Clippy. It looks like you're trying to restore this facility. Would you like help? How do I shut this thing up? You also find tons of side missions, where you can explore a whole bunch of uncharted worlds in your space tank, and you'll get to fight everything from space raiders to hungry hungry caterpillars. I'm not sure why the tank is called the Mako though. I can only assume someone googled sharks that suck at climbing mountains and it kind of stuck. You can also run around the citadel. You'll find tons to do such as shopping and helping out people who flag you down because of your celebrity status. Hello Spectre. And you can also enjoy Shepard's butt crack. You gotta watch out for this dude though because he's got Annie Wilkes written all over him. And your grace and skill have inspired a whole legion of admirers, too. Hey, can I get your picture? I'm your number one fan. Oh, also, strip clubs.
All kidding aside, this game is amazing. The characters in the universe are absolutely incredible, and the popularity of the original trilogy is truly well deserved. The Legendary Edition has really brought Mass Effect up the standard, and you should definitely free this one from your backlog. Okay, so I'm kind of making this up as I go, so let me know what you want to see. My next video is probably going to be Bloodborne, because everybody with a PS5 gets it free, but a lot of people are still too scared to play it. Thanks for watching. Bye!